just thought I'd give a quick tutorial on how to um, best confirm uh, a blown or a stripped uh, plastic cam gear on a 425 or 445 with a Kawasaki engine. Um, this is a 1996 445. Um, it's got 686 hours on it. And um, I bought it. Uh, the owner said that um, the deer dealership uh, had, said it had a bad camshaft or bad cam gear and it was going to be about $1,500 to fix. Um, so the machine's actually in pretty good shape other than the cam gear but you know just to be sure make sure I uh, didn't get really lucky and have some uh, really easy problem to solve I want to confirm that yes indeed the cam gear is what is causing the problem. Um, so what I did is I went ahead and uh, I did a compression test um, using my compression tester here and just pulled the spark plug out, did a compression test, came up with about uh, 30 uh, PSI on the compression. So we know that the, the pistons are moving in and out. So um, the next thing to do uh, to confirm the cam gear has been stripped is to take the valve cover off. And I've already loosened these to some degree. Uh, what you need is you just need a 10 millimeter uh, um, socket and like I said I already loosened some of these I thought they were a little looser than that so I could just take them off but this is a pretty easy process you can just take one valve cover off that will pretty much determine um, the whole shoot and match here pretty easy process I'll have to look up the torque specs for these bolts if it is not the camshaft. I'll also have to get a new gasket. Anytime you take the valve covers off, it's best to spend the, well, I think the last time I bought some, $2.50 or $4 to buy new gaskets for the valve covers. So you just take the valve cover off. And there are the valves, and the best way to check to see if the camshaft is, or the cam gear is stripped, is if the valves move when I crank it. And my guess is they probably will not. They do not. So that tells us that, yes indeed, the uh, camshaft or the cam gear is stripped. So um, we'll proceed from there. But that's how you do it. Figure it would be a quick tutorial video.